Hello friends, this is DMC um, and this is my quick coffee of the month video for August and a lot of um, coffees this month, uh, the only supermarket coffees that I drank were Nespresso um, pods so I've got these in some sort of order from when I, the first that I drank of the month which was the Horsebox Coffee Co. This was the Dark Horse and not too impressed with this one but it's really smooth and nice enough just lacking a bit of character I thought this one and that scored a 3.5 out of 5. The next one is the Cafe Pod Brunch Blend and this one very basic in taste and very acidic one of the weaker coffees um, that Cafe Pod do which are usually super strong um, and that scored a 2.75 out of 5 the next coffee the Hub Excited one full bodied and nice um, as a cappuccino this one it's got a decent robusta taste and has a quite a caffeine kick to it a good coffee this one and that scored a 3.75 out of 5 the next one the cafe pod intense roast and a decent arabica robusta blend that's smooth and well balanced this one that scored a 3 out of 5 the next coffee the hub eccentric one a coffee that got better and more interesting the more I drank it and a good Brazilian coffee and this one was my favourite of the hub coffees that I reviewed and that scored a 4 out of 5 the next coffee the La or India um, co coffee pods overly rich and I found it very bitter and acidic it's rather bland but one of the better sort of or coffees um, that I tried but slightly more expensive than the others in the range but my coffee of the month for the third time in a row which is quite amazing it's um, Gunslinger's Coffee Sumatra Coffee Beans super smooth with an interesting sourness it was quite complex in taste and was narrowly the best coffee I drank in August but it was a close run thing with um, this one and the uh, Hub Eccentric one which were both excellent coffees I didn't even realise until it was pointed out to me that Gunslingers had won coffee of the month in June and July and they were up against some excellent coffees too so I can't I really can't recommend them highly enough this one along with the El Salvador the Honduran and the Ethiopian were all top coffees so that's my coffee of the month I'd really like to hear from anyone who's tried Gunslingers coffees um, or any of the others that I mentioned in this this um, month's coffee of the month let me know your thoughts in the comments section below if you like this video give it a thumbs up and if you want to see more coffee reviews in the future subscribe to my channel that was my coffee of the month for august 2020 thanks for watching bye for now Mm-hmm. <laughs>